You know, Shane been toting this mouse pattern around on his hat all day long. Now it's time to finally put it to use right before dark. You gotta listen to Shane's story. Yeah, right, right behind me, right down here off the cliff, um, where all the uh, foam is, is actually the hole that uh, all the magic happened. Um, it was pretty sweet. Yeah, I seen it come up and it missed the fly because a lot of times the big fish will come up and try and stun the mouse and drown it and then come back and hit it. So I just was patient because I saw it hit and I just was sitting there and I might have cast out again or just let it go and the fish just came back downstream like four feet down the hole and just smacked it, just devoured it and uh, set the hook and it was on. And uh, instantly, man, I just, I just knew that was a big fish. You know, back in West Virginia, we call that a jacuzzi. That water was bubbling right there. Woo! Thing is heavy. Jeez. This is a strong, big fish. I mean, these fish in here are really smart. They'll just run upstream and take a left turn out of boulder and just cut your line. So. Uh, you know, I was standing there and it was just going around the little run right there and then all of a sudden it decided I don't like this thing in my mouth. <laughs> Went to the boulder and that's when everything got interesting. At that point I just had to run after the fish and just keep it tight and not let it wrap me. So basically it, whenever the fish moved I had to move with it. I think I'm going on a merry-go-round. <laughs> no! There you go. There you go turn an angle, you know, because you can't lift those big fish up. You can just change your head angles, the direction of your rod, and they'll switch their head to a different direction. So I'd switch an angle, and the fish would turn, and then I'd go with it, and then they would tell me it wants to go the back towards the boulder, so then I'd have to turn with the fish. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was a pretty sweet fight. It was a battle. This thing's tiring me out. <sighs> All right, back on another ride. You're crouched down in, on a rock in the middle of the river, and, and Shane is doing a powwow dance around the rock, around one side, back around the other side. I'm thinking, what in the world is going on? The main concern in my head was just, how am I gonna turn this fish and get it to go downstream? You know, and then I realized the rod is bent over. Got that one good head turn and it just took off got in the main run again and that's when Ryan came down. And I get about 50 yards away and I see this big square tail come up out of the water and I realize he's into a monster fish. Hey, thanks man, I appreciate it. Wow, this is a beast, man. Woo! We're just standing there, both of us just all, oh, this thing's going around our legs and trying to swim between his legs. <laughs> <laughs> you know, these boys are all out of shape. You know, Shane, he's huffing and puffing. Ryan, he's stumbling around. If that was me out there, I'd take trout aerobics. I'd be all, I'd be huffing and puffing too. <laughs> uh... <laughs> And finally, it just like got up on the surface a little bit that he could just jump in and just great net job, just straight onto it, boop, popped it out. And there we are, just standing there, just, what? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh! Holy cow! <laughs> oh my oh god! My god. Now that is a fish. Mouse fish. <laughs> my god, we got. Oh my god, man. You know, I mean, I'm just thankful to be able to come up and fish with you guys too and guide you guys a little and be able to fish a little and you don't even know how much this means to me. I guide this river all year and uh, to be able to come out and fish just a little in the evening with you guys and have fun, throw out the mouse and have this come out. That's an incredible fish. Oh my god. Just about dark. We caught some amazing fish, and this absolutely ends the day. So, what a monster. What mm -hmm. a monster. Wow. This is a fish of a lifetime, man. 
All right, look at this thing. What an incredible fish. <laughs> On a mouse. <laughs> like we were saying earlier to Curtis, uh, you know, these fish are packing on pounds for the winter. Um, there's some really, really big fish up here on the Brazos. Happy, healthy, 22, 24 inch rainbow. Ate the mouse. Just magnificent. All right. Make sure he's, there he goes. He's right, he's on your feet. Just took off. Can't beat it. I mean, what an incredible day. I think we'll ever be able to top that. That's gonna be really hard. Hey, there's a lot more going on in Fly Rod Chronicles behind the scene. If you wanna check it out, join us on Facebook or Twitter.